Yo, what's up guys, welcome back. Uh, we're gonna do the reviews of the the pilot captains. Um, I actually noticed that I didn't do the uh, the leader skills of the sharks, uh, but it's all attack speed for their own uh, element. So it's 23% accuracy for either fire, wind, water, light or dark, which is pretty good. Pretty awesome uh, leader skill for those units. So have a look at those badass looking guys, because I think they look awesome. It's an attack monster, uh, not that high attack to be honest, but let's see. Swiftly attacks an enemy, weakest defense for one turn with a 75% chance. Not terrible. Uh, orders, <laughs> orders a ship to fire bombard, bombardment of three rounds to attack random target. Each hit 75% chance stunning enemy. Well, it's pretty good. Even though it's random, it does have a stun on him. So it's pretty cool. I want to see how this skill looks to be honest. Detonation shot. Fires a carefully aimed shot that deals great damage. This attack sets of the bomb effects on target. Pretty interesting because this could combo with like Jojo. Like Jojo put out bombs, then you could let him go and and he just shots and he gets one bomb off. It's not as good as uh, Sierra where every bomb goes down and uh, every dot, but it does work. And we have attack power in guild battles only. Okay. Oh, then I want to check one quick thing if the sharks are all so only in guild battles. No, that's everywhere. I must say those uh, the fact that it's in guild battles only makes it a little bit less cool. I mean, why would you put it only in guild battles? That's a bit. You could have done it like in arena and guild battles, make that like the same thing. But I guess they want to distinguish monsters from uh, where you want to use them. But hey, there we go. Next pirate, Galleon, an HP monster. It's a fire. It's a water one. Let's see what he has. The same, pretty, still pretty cool. Pirate side deals a powerful attack to an enemy and absorbs 30% of its attack bar. Interesting. But what I don't understand, why is an HP monster with a powerful attack? I don't understand that. Time to loot. Unleashes a battle cry that increases the attack power of all allies for two turns. Okay, this so it's a buff for attack power and decreases defense. Oh, nice. Time to loot is pretty awesome. Because you can just. Okay, you guys have no defense and I have an attack buff. That's basically what you want. That's pretty awesome. I like this one. The water one is good. And again, in guild battles. For guild battles it's good as well. I like the one. The water one is pretty awesome. I would definitely make him like a, a tank, a water tank. Where I just use him for that buff. And maybe I make a hybrid so he does some de decent damage. Definitely uh, do like him. Okay. Whoa, he has low attack for an attack monster. Same as before. Deals a power of attack. Yeah, same as before. Performs a backspin that connects the pyramid strike on a don't know, it's just a hard hit probably. Don't really like it too much. Don't like the wind one. Do not like the wind one. The light and dark are often not to be seen as a four stars, but we'll just go through the unit real quick, see what he does. This one is an attack. It looks already have he has a better attack. Deals powerful Attack the enemy, yeah. Attacks enemy and decrease the defense and attack power of the enemy for two turns with a 75% chance. And makes the enemy unable to receive beneficial effects. Pretty cool. This arm is pretty awesome uh, attack. It's definitely a unit that can uh, focus one uh, guy down. That's what he's used for. So uh, definitely a DPS unit that you want to build. Probably on violent to be honest. I think it, on violent he would do great. Obviously, rage blade is off an option, but I like putting violent on such a unit because he has that that potential, you know, to get defense break and then hit again. Uh, yeah, bombardment just like the other one, the fire one. Increase the attack bar of all allies and reduce the cooldown. Okay, this is pretty cool. Full speed ahead. Nice buff. Nobody's gonna get this one, but if you get it, full spear head is a pretty cool skill. 
The water one is really awesome. I like the water one. Water one is just like you can utilize him pretty damn well. With uh, yeah, with this, this is a pretty awesome uh, time to loot if you combo it with like monsters that do AoE damage. It's good. I would like to see this one with uh, for um, for TOA as well, and then just put time to loot on, and then just do my win different, let him go loose. Ah, that would be cool. So those are the pirates. Uh, the water one I really like. The fire one has some interesting skills, but the rest is like meh. The, the light one is good, but highly unlikely that you get it. But overall, pretty funny units. Sadly, they're only used for uh, kill battles when it comes to leader skill. So half the time that won't be doing much. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll be back with the mermaids.